Today we're going to show you how to hook up an AFR enhancer, air fuel ratio sensor. This is different than an oxygen sensor enhancer or IFI uh, because on the Toyotas particularly of later vintage we find that they do not use an oxygen sensor pre-catalytic. They use an AFR sensor. This mechanism right here is one of the very few if not the only mechanism or device, electronic device, to actually lean out an air fuel ratio sensor or wad band oxygen sensor. You can see there's a light on here, this is the pilot light. Once we start the vehicle up this will power up and come on and this is the adjusting screw right here to lean it out. If you go all the way to the left Counterclockwise, it is actually off, does very little, if anything. As you turn it to the right, clockwise, if you turn it all the way up, you'll get about 5.3 milliamps, which is more than enough to lean out an air fuel ratio sensor. The most that you'll be adjusting this screw is probably one fourth, maximum half, is more than you need. Uh, we'll start off with one fourth uh, clockwise then get take a few mileage reading on your vehicle to see if you got a gain on it. If you're getting good gain you can go up a little bit more but be careful if you go up beyond halfway you can burn a valve in an engine because it will lean out much easier than a regular narrow band oxygen sensor. So we're going to show you some things about the, uh, this particular device how it hooks up. It's very simple. <clears throat> the white wire and the green wire this is a for dual uh, air fuel racial sensor. The green wire we're not using because this vehicle is a four cylinder that only has one air fuel racial sensor before the catalytic converter. If you had two this one would go to the other one. So this is the uh, wire we got hooked up to the air fuel racial sensor right here. We've identified it where I'm pointing. That's the signal wire. You don't cut the signal wire. You merely strip it back once you identify the wire for the signal for the air fuel racial sensor and you twist the wire around it and solder it right into the circuit. Do not split it, do not cut it in half, strip it back and solder the wire for the signal wire into that. You could use the white or the green. If you had two, like I said, you this one would go to the other signal wire pre-catalytic converter air fuel racial sensor. You have a ground wire right here that simply goes to the body ground. This red wire right here would go to the powering up of this air fuel ratio sensor off the same circuit that you use to power up the hydrogen generator. We're going to start the vehicle up. As you watch it start up you'll see the green pilot light come on. <clears throat> Okay, we got it running right now. As you can see, if you look closely here, see if I can zoom in a little bit, you'll see the uh, green pilot light. The green pilot light in the set screw. Where are we right on it right now. Okay, we're going to put the screwdriver right in here. We'll turn it all the way counterclockwise. It's already off. We're going to move the screw about one fourth of the way. You're not going to hear any change in the engine as per se, but one fourth of the way is where we're going to leave it to run our fuel mileage test. We get good mileage, we'll try to crack it up a little bit more, but we won't go beyond halfway because you'll over lean it and you can possibly burn a valve with this type of instrument, this type of enhancing device. Uh, this is a very effective device. The only other one that I know that's on the market costs over $200. Uh, that will is an air fuel ratio calibrator. This is an enhancer, and this will work on those Toyotas that have the air fuel ratio sensors. We ha we can get these for you. You can just contact us. They're not on our website. If you need one of these, we hope that you rate this video. We hope that this device can give you better fuel mileage and also improve the economy in regard to the environment. We know the gas prices are going up and we're trying to do everything that we can in these videos to help people improve their fuel mileage and the pollution, uh, the emissions that are coming out of the exhaust. So we want to do this properly. Please rate the video. Thank you for watching.